everybody. Sweet and Salty Sisters here with you. We wanted to talk to you about a news story that we saw on Facebook. It was about a New Jersey councilwoman, um, Roselle Park. Uh, her name is Charlene Story, and she's a councilwoman. And the council had voted on changing the name of a tree lighting ceremony. And they wanted to change it officially to Christmas tree lighting ceremony in their town. And then you can tell what happened next. And so she decided that she didn't like that because it was um, biased against other religious groups. And so she put in a resignation. So she resigned and be, be, did, was a big baby, even though it was um, voted on by the council and passed by the council, which is how that's democracy, folks. Uh, it was voted <laughs> on and, and that's what happened. So she quit. She said, I'm going to take my ball and go home. And so she quit. Um, and then, then the mayor called her, the mayor of this town called her and talked to her about it. And then what happened? So then she decided to rescind her resignation letter. Yeah. She rescinded her resignation letter and the mayor said he was going to create, um, a special committee on diversity and let her lead that committee. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> that really truly is like. Somebody being like, well, I'm mad. I'm taking my ball and going home. And then you go into their house and be like, come back out and play. Come back out and play. We'll give you an extra ball. I'll let we'll, you go first. Yeah, we'll let you go first. We'll let you win. I'm sorry, what? But they said they're going to go ahead and have the Christmas tree lighting ceremony, but she's not going to attend. What? Poor sportsmanship. Poor, poor. I Okay, first of all. You know she rescinded her resignation because, you know, oh, wait, I need a job. Right. How am I going to pay my bills? Oh, yeah. I need, I need that job. Insurance, yeah. We need, yeah. I need that. So she forgot. She forgot she needed a paycheck. So I never forget I need a paycheck. Okay. So I, I'm just really, really tired of the PC garbage in the world. Um, first of all, what other kind of trees do you light up? We have to call it a tree lighting ceremony, not a Christmas tree lighting. How many of you folks light a tree other that's not a Christmas tree? I mean, seriously, it had to have been a Christmas tree. That's a Christian tradition. That's a Christmas tradition. It came from Martin Luther, supposedly, which, I mean, might be made up. But I, I had always heard that Martin Luther was the first person to do that, to bring a tree into his house. And he put candles on it. Which is um, dangerous. Right? Fire hazard, people. Even now, people's trees burn up with just regular, like, plug-in lights yeah, because it's so dry. Water on. Yeah. So there are people who still bring trees in and put candles on them. Um, we all have Christmas trees in our house. And the thing is, I mean, there, I mean, there are a lot of people who celebrate Christmas who it's just a day of presents. That's all it is. It's and it doesn't have any meaning beyond that for them. And I think that you know that's fine if that's what you want to do. I think it's odd, but. Um, I mean, I wasn't, we didn't go to church when I was growing up. And so I didn't realize, so I was probably like 10 years old, what Christmas really was. So for me, Christmas was presents and a tree and I didn't know any different, but I feel like there are some people who are just trying to be difficult, just looking to be offended all the time. Like the Starbucks cups. Right. The Starbucks cups or the, the Christmas sweater that said, um, it said OCD, obsessive Christmas disorder. I love that. I'm wearing that. I thought it was hilarious. And I think that, and I talked to even people who have really truly have OCD and none of them were offended by it. They thought it was funny and they thought it was an ugly sweater they would never wear. But if somebody's into that, that they were not going to be offended by it. That was now. I think in this generation, everybody's so quick to get so easily like offended about everything. Mm -hmm. I mean, they just want something to be mad about. Mm -hmm. And I just don't understand that. Like the whole Starbucks cups thing. Because they're not putting um, Christmas trees or um, snowflakes or whatever on it. Supposedly some Christians were offended by it and upset. And it started a whole thing over Facebook. But all the friends that I have that are Christians, we all agree. We don't care. It's a cup. You're going to throw it away anyway. And none of those things are actually the true meaning of Christmas anyway. So no Christians are really offended by it. Right. That's just something somebody else started. Yeah, I think that's like one or two people got upset about it. And then the whole world exploded over it. But, mm -hmm. I mean, this lady in New Jersey, I just think, I think it's hilarious. She she had her little huff and quit Is because she didn't get her way. I mean, think about that. If 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 Congress people and, and leaders didn't get their way, that they would just quit when they didn't get their way. I'm sorry. It's not all about you. That is tired of the PC garbage all the time everybody's always tiptoeing around everybody else and you know what that's there's so much more other stuff important so I mean, imagine all the important stuff that they could have been discussing in this council meeting 
uh, for their family, for their family, for their town. Well, and they had to, some time. They, well, and they had to spend time ta- arguing. I'm sure with this lady about a Christmas, tree a Christmas tree lighting ceremony. I'm sorry, that's what the tree is for. You, you don't put it up for anything else. It's, it's Christmas. So anyway, that's that's what we think about it. What do you think about it? We'd like to know. Comment on this video and let us know what you think. And until next time, keep it sweet. Keep it salty. See ya.